Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the next video. I'm going to be talking about the root chakra. This is the last chakra, or the lowest chakra, uh, geographically. It is the foundation. It is your body's foundation. Without this, you cannot operate or function. With the foundation, or with this chakra, there is nothing really to be done. You can't really work on it in any way. You can just build it and strengthen it and, and uh, raise its energy. But... Uh, Moving it around or opening it, so to speak, is out of question. Some magicians or mystical people that practice the occult and magic, real magic, they do, they tend to open the center up because when you open it up, you have the ability to access the, you have the ability to access life, right? To the very, um, yeah. So you can manipulate physical matter in this way. You can uh, choose to manipulate life even if you do open this up. But if you open it up, it's like, you know, opening up the foundation of your own home. Uh, everything that you have in your house will just join away. And that's exactly what happens when you do open up the, the, um, the root chakra. All of the energy that you've accumulated will just sink down. And uh, you will not have any spirituality in your life. Also, um, some mystical people have the ability to move their root chakra and put it into another organism, another body, and they can move that body around and you know manipulate that body, but you're leaving this body unattended. And uh, that could also lead to some challenges. But uh, when we get down to some practical aspects of this chakra, the root chakra, it is your connection to life. It is the foundation. If you have this strong and rooted, then you'll feel safe, you'll feel secure. That's actually the, the very, uh, it's the fa fundamental essence of this uh, energy is safety. Like I said in the previous video, one of the easiest ways to distort your first three basic chakras is unhealthy sexual activity. And there is nothing that weakens this chakra um, than inappropriate sexual acts. And I will talk about that in a future video. Creating favorable living circumstances for yourself, like finding a place that you can call a home and you can rest, and uh, getting adequate amount of sleep, and eating properly and being in a safe environment is what is conducive towards this energy. And the last thing that I will say is that there is a tremendous amount of stored energy, potential energy, in the base of this uh, of your spine. The root chakra is located in the PC muscles, the perineum. You can Google where that is. It's uh, right between your genital organs and the anal outlet, that spot. And that place has a tremendous amount of energy locked away that's dormant. And if you learn to coax this to come awaken, to come alive and to raise up that's what we call kundalini energy um, so that is the whole practice of spirituality is to awaken your kundalini and there are various methods of doing that you can do it fast and there are repercussions for that or you can do it slowly and you know take more time but you'll be more safe so learning how to coax this dormant energy in the base of your spine to raise upwards is what is all of spiritual practice all about. And I'm going to talk about how to do that in future videos.